Let's fire it off! What? No way! Not to! Lucy! Juvia! Ah, it would seem you're resistant to cold. I'll freeze you out. What's going on? I'm Invelura, Winter General. A title I've earned for obvious reasons. You may handle the chill, but I bring winter itself. No. How can this be happening? I actually feel cold. It's like the blood in my veins is freezing. Someone help me. Invil must be defeated, or we'll be lost forever. Ice make magic! Ice shield! Ice make magic! Ice impact! Ice creation magic, I see. It's no wonder you have an immunity to the cold. I don't believe it. He froze my ice spell? I use ice magic in a more absolute sense. Not merely creating objects from ice, instead freezing everything to its very core. This maker magic you wield is an inferior derivative of true ice wizardry. I can shatter your spells with barely any effort. Is that so? Then what about this? I got it from my father. The power to slay demons. <laughs> this is how I'm gonna kill E.N.D. Ice Demon Zero Longsword! Uh, 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 uh. Uh, uh. How can this be? I've never seen it before. Demon Slayer magic? He can use it to create powerful magic weapons, but it seems like there's a steep cost involved, as if it's taking something away from him. Perhaps this power robs the wielder of their very own humanity. How fascinating. <laughs> What's going on? It's snowing? Feels more like a blizzard to me. First we had a sandstorm, now this? Invel's doing it. It's so cold, but I can't let him freeze me. I gotta fight. You're unique. I believe you have what it takes to be one of us. <laughs> Surely you must have noticed this by now. But your heart is slowly filling with darkness. What? I'm gonna listen to this crap! Magic grew from the darkness, the abyss of sorcery. This is why His Majesty uses it himself. So that means you guys actually see yourselves as villains, huh? Our side has no concept of good or evil. Darkness is a powerful force that exists inside everyone, regardless of your creed. It's strong in you. You can barely contain it. That's it. I've heard enough of this. If you knew me at all, you'd know I've never been much of a white knight type. I'll protect my fairy tale family by doing whatever the hell I gotta do! You tell him, Gray! <laughs> because that's the fairy tale way! I'm not a posicle anymore! <laughs> Are you okay? You guys! 
Natsu managed to melt my ice. I suppose it makes sense considering his origin. All right, it's our turn now. I say we give him a fairy stampede! Hey! What the? Put him down! What are you doing? I'm taking what's rightfully mine. Like hell you are! Let us go! I realize you're mad, Brandish, but we didn't know. Be quiet. <laughs> Get back here! What are we supposed to do now? <sighs> Juvia! Great, darling. I feel so weird. Like my head is spinning out of control. I can't move at all. It's like my body refuses to. It's ice lock. It constrains your mind thus turning you into my puppet. Regardless how you may feel inside, you will do my bidding. You will fight to the death. Kill each other? <laughs> yes, and you will remain in these shackles until one of you dies. This won't hold me. Screw you! <laughs> I can't. This is perfect. I know Grey will prevail in this fight. And at the very moment he kills his friend, the darkness in him will take over. His majesty won't be the one to defeat E.N.D. Grey will do it, I've no doubt. Juvia. Grey, dear. No, I refuse. I can't hurt the love of my life. Instead, while I still have a little control, I'll have to kill myself! Now have at it. The winner gets to live. My mind... I feel like it's fading away. No, I... I won't hurt my darling Grey. I don't want to, but... I can't focus. I'm losing control. <laughs> Gray will win this fight just as I predicted. Killing his dear friend with his own two hands will unleash the darkness within him. Creating the apex warrior who shall defeat E.N.D. His Majesty will vanquish Agnologia. Then the world will truly be his. But to fully realize this goal, E.N.D. must be removed. Why? Why am I trying to harm my love like this? It goes against every fiber of my being. I would truly rather die than see him suffer. Please, my darling. Hurry and kill me. No, that wouldn't work. He would blame himself. His heart would be broken. It's clear what I must do now. I have no other choice. Yes, I shall take my own life. I'll do it before I lose what control I still have. I have to be brave. This is for the best. Don't bother resisting. My ice lock magic imprisons your mind. Its cold shackles confine your free will. To earn release, you must kill the one before you. My feelings will never be confined, but if my body is trying to imprison them, then I must destroy it! <laughs> you awaken the best part of me. Gray, my love. That's absurd! Choosing self-destruction? <laughs> Juvia, you didn't have to. <gasps> They'd both rather end their lives? <laughs> I'm sorry. I thought... My darling Grey, you shouldn't have... There was no other choice. 
I couldn't hurt you, Juvia. You mean too much to me. You're my friend. I feel the same. I just wanted to protect you. But now I... You're so kind. My very last moment is a happy one. What the hell is going on here? I never saw this coming. Damn it. It wasn't supposed to turn out this way. Natsu, please, don't let us die in vain. Avenge us. They couldn't live with the guilt of killing a friend, so instead they killed themselves. It's absolutely mind-boggling. I'll have to think of another strategy. But as things stand now, it seems the only option left is to deal with END myself. Uh. Hey! The blizzard stopped! It's about time! What's going on? I'm still alive. But how? I mean, I know what I did. It's so strange. The blood inside me. Somehow it doesn't feel like my own. Water make blood. I'd been worried that something terrible would happen to you, my love. So I secretly mastered a blood transfusion spell that would let me care for you. I'll always be alive inside of you. So don't cry. We'll still be together. No, you can't die. Juvia. My life is yours now. We're inseparable. <laughs> I need you to focus. Ice make Kaiser! Water Nebula! Get down! I can still feel the warmth of Grace's hand on my Toshi! Juvia. Listen for a sec. There's something I've been meaning to tell you for a while now. Um, whatever something is, I'm ready to hear it. I mean, it's not that big of a deal, but... You never know, it might be a really big deal for me! Could this be the moment I've always dreamed of? Will he confess his love to me at last? Oh my goodness, what will I say? I was knitting in a rush, so it didn't turn out very good. But I'd be honored if you wore it. Here, please. You should get home before it starts storming. Uh, ah, what the hell? I knitted a scarf for you. Won't you wear it? I don't do scarves. Come on, uh, it's a cute accessory. I don't accessorize either. But it's gonna get cold out. Look at those clouds. So what? I'm an ice wizard, all right? The cold doesn't even affect me. Sorry. I want to make up for my mistake. <laughs> so I made you this body pillow. Uh, Here, do whatever you no want with way. it. No <laughs> way. It's also in commemoration of our 414th day anniversary, uh, so you know, it'd be pretty rude not to take it. Seriously, <gasps> that thing's creepy. Take it back. Creepy? Gray, my darling. Aren't you glad I brought my special two-person sleeping bag with me on this trip? No way I'm getting in that thing. I have a surprise for you, my darling Gray. <sighs> Something warm for you to munch on. Ah. I call them gray buns. Well, they do look pretty tasty, but it would feel weird to gnaw on my own face. 
I thought you'd say that. Guess I'll keep all the gray buns for myself. Which means you get to enjoy these hot juicy buns. You set me up. You went through all the trouble. I might as well eat one. Oh, my darling. That's a gray bun. Mm. It was you. You freed him. Thank you. Thank you. Great. I'm sorry. Are you okay, my love? I'm fine. Care for a bite? Wow! My darling Gray is sharing his food with me! His lips touched this! I hope you know I appreciate you. I can always count on you to be by my side, right? Oh, well, yes, of course, my love, if that's what you want. I'll give you my answer once the battle is over. But for now, let me focus on this. Sure. Oh, Juvia. I'm sorry for the way I've treated you. I promise I'll take your feelings seriously. Just please, wake up. Juvia. I believe Brandish was headed in this direction. To think that you actually survived. <laughs> However, I imagine that you're still too injured for a proper fight. How? He's forced my hand. I've no choice but to take a drastic measure. Absolute Ice Shroud! This netherworld ice freezes all that it touches. You may think you're resistant, but any contact with this armor will freeze you to your core. And then you'll shatter into pieces. How could this be? This wizard is able to duplicate the same properties as my Neverworld Ice? Juvia had a life ahead of her, a future. And you stole it from her! I'll make you pay. Uh -huh. oh! You're the one who's gonna shatter! Ice Demon, Zero Destruction Fist! I could keep thrashing you, and as good as that would feel, it still wouldn't bring her back. Like your long-lost mother, your father, your master, right? How do you know about all that? Because it's your fate in this life. Unless you defeat END, misery will follow you for the rest of your days. I am gonna take him down. I don't need you to tell me. The truth is, you're the only one in this world who can beat him. However, you should know his other name. Ethereus Natsu Dragneel. 
He is the mightiest demon of the books of Zerif. Which means he's your ultimate foe. <laughs>